Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Caitlin and I upload three times a week on this channel. Wednesdays are fashion and lifestyle videos, Fridays are weekly university vlogs and Sundays are my unsolved Sundays where I discuss some sort of unsolved disappearance case, mystery case, anything along those lines. So today I'm back with another one of my like, basically it's just a haul, it's a try on haul, a very large one. I have this massive, massive package here from Zapple that I was very kindly gifted. I picked most of it out and they sent me uh, some of their products like picks for me. So as always, I'm just gonna be 100% honest and give you kind of like my full review of these products. This is like newer season products and try them all on for you, see how they fit. As always, all my opinions are 100% honest. I have already looked at most of these products because I've had this package sat in my room for so long. I even had to bring it home with me from uni. So yeah, I'm just gonna give you my honest opinion on everything, fit and how it looks and everything and we shall just get started. So when I placed the order, this top was just over $11. So it's definitely not like super expensive. I got this in a size medium to large and it's just a ribbed off the shoulder cream top. Because of the rib material, it looks super stretchy. So kind of like it's very forgiving, but for someone like me who does have kind of a smaller chest, it does look a little bit big to me. But if it fits, it seems super comfy, like it's really soft and, like I said, very forgiving. So if this fits well, then it would be great. It would be like a really nice basic to have, wear under dungarees and stuff. So this is another one of the basics that I'm very, very happy with. It is a little bit big on me, just because just I have quite a small chest. Um, it's good quality, it's thick and it's soft as well, so it's not going to irritate your skin. Everything stretches, so... If you're a little bit smaller, then it will, you know, stick to you. And if you're a little bit bigger, then it will stretch. So that's great. I'm really, really happy with this one. I think this is going to be really nice to wear in the summertime. Next, I have this jacket that I it was probably like the thing that I was most excited for in this haul. This was just over $29, which in the grand scheme of sort of faux leather moto jackets, it isn't that expensive at all. And it's a proper like cherry red colour, which I love. It is thinner than I thought, um, like thinner than most of my other leather jackets but I suppose that's kind of what you expect when you're ordering from some sort of like a cheaper website. I got this in a size extra large I think just to be safe because I don't want it to be too tight. It doesn't I don't think it looks too cheap or anything so again depending on how it fits I'm quite happy with that one if it looks okay. Okay so this definitely is on the thinner side of my leather jackets it's not the most thick or expensive looking and it is pretty creased at the moment because I obviously kept it in the packaging while I've been traveling about and stuff. So yeah, it's nice, I like it, and I'm definitely gonna wear it, but it, like, don't be fooled, it isn't the most high-end looking jacket, but I really like the color of it, and I think it's definitely gonna do, especially for summer, it'll be perfect. Another red item, there was obviously a theme going on. So this one is a play suit. Uh, I got this in a size large, and it's one of these play suits, it's off the shoulder, it's kind of this shared like material across the chest, and then, you slip your arms in these little flowy sleeves. Little pair of shorts at the bottom. They're really flowy, they're not see-through or anything. So I think, again, if this fits, this will look so cute. I can't imagine this with like some over-the-knee black boots or something. Really fun to dress up. And this one was $18.99. I absolutely love this. I think this is so cute. It fits really well. It's not too short, I think, if you can see, and it's flowy as well. Again, it's not like scratchy or anything, so it's not gonna irritate your skin, and I can I'm so excited to wear this out actually. I think I might wear this out to be perfect for like cocktail evening or on holiday. We were last to out to dinner. So this okay, this might be the other favourite thing of the whole haul. <laughs> right, so this one was one of the ones that they picked for me. So like I said, there was a couple of products that uh, they actually picked out for me to try. So I don't know. I, I don't really know what I'm getting. So this one is a size medium, but it looks very large for a medium. So it's a little off the shoulder top, little kind of black tube bandeau top and then the sleeves are like feathery and I'm not gonna lie, I think I would probably wear this on a night out with a pair of high-waisted black jeans if it fit me but I am very very sceptical as to the sizing on this one. So if you are kind of like a size 8 with very large boobs this will fit you perfectly but um, I could be wrong but it does just look very large for me because I'm so flat chested so we'll try that one out and this one was just under ten dollars okay so unfortunately this top just doesn't fit me uh this is way too big i don't know if you can see which i anticipated but also what i didn't expect was that i can't even get my arms in these sleeves i think it's because they are like stiff so they don't stretch at all so um fortunately despite this one being really cute it definitely doesn't fit me so this black mini skirt it's a denim mini skirt this was uh, just over 23 dollars again isn't expensive at all in the grand scheme of things so i'm actually 
I think this will be okay. Usually I'm a little bit kind of hesitant with denim skirts because I have quite long legs. I have 34 inch legs. So usually even if it fits size wise, it's quite short, but I don't think they look too bad actually. You do have to cut a hole, like a hole yourself in the little buckle bit, but yeah, I'm really happy with that one as long as that fits. Again, this will be like a basic staple in my wardrobe. Uh, I haven't cut the hole in the little button bit yet, so please ignore that, but I don't know how well you can see the length, but it's a perfect length. It's short enough to still be a mini skirt on me, even though I'm still quite tall, but it's not too long. I literally love it, and I think this is gonna become like quite a staple in my wardrobe. It's, it's thick as well, so you know it's good quality. So this was $23.99 and this is one of the items that I have already worn. I wore it in a, it was one of the styling videos, might have been an outfit of the week maybe. So it's a white or it's kind of like an off-white, off the shoulder jumper. It's super comfy, like it's so soft. Um, I'm, I'm, it's kind of a shame this has come at the time it did because I would have gotten so much more use out of it in the colder months. But this is just, it looks so cute tucked into a little uh, skirt or something. Yeah, really happy with this one, I can tell you, because I have already worn it many times. I've definitely worn this one before, but I really, really like it. It's so soft, and it's just really thick as well, so you know it's a really good quality, especially for the price that you buy it for. Uh, I've just tucked it in, but it's like this kind of length, full length, which on me just looks kind of a bit boxy, so that's why I like to tuck it in um, and wear it with a belt. And yeah, it's super comfy. I'm definitely going to still be wearing this about now, so I'm really happy with this one. I'm going through a little bit of like a dungaree kind of overalls phase at the moment so I saw this dress and I thought this would look really cute again if it fits right over sort of a white long sleeve top or even just a black one just as kind of like an overall dress I got this in a size medium and this was this was 28.47 it ties sort of like each side of the waist or just under the bust it looks like so hopefully that should be nice and fitted even if it is a little bit big for me um it's more of a skate dress than I thought but I'll give it a go. So this one is super cute. It's definitely a lot more of a fit and flair like skate dress than what I usually wear, but I'm actually in love with it. I think it's so cute. It fits really well. So um, these two, you can just sort of ad adjust to fit your waist or just under your bust, which is great because it means it's really flattering. It doesn't swallow you and it's not too low here. So you could still wear it as a dress by itself if you wanted, or like I'm wearing it like a dungaree dress. So I'm really, really happy with this one. I think this might be one of my favorite items in the whole haul. So this is another item that they picked out for me. It was 14 49 but obviously you can't really go wrong with a graphic tee, so it's like a cropped square white tee with just this, like lotus flower print on it. Can't really complain with a graphic tee. If I don't wear this, I'll, I'll wear it as loungewear or pyjamas or something, so yeah, very happy with that one. This top is so comfy. Um, it's definitely going to be one of my sort of like loungewear tops. Just chuck it on with a pair of jeans or some joggers and it's so comfy. It isn't see-through either, which is great. This little pink cami top was 11 99 and it's very similar to something that I ordered from Forever 21 that didn't actually fit me. But I'm really happy with the length of this one and it's adjustable straps as well. So even if it comes down a little bit too low, I can adjust it. It's quite cropped, so I think this will look cute on an evening out with some high-waisted jeans or something. Um, again, it's like nice material, it's thick, so very happy with this one. I really like this one. I think the colour is really cute. It's going to be great for summer, it makes you look quite tan. And it's not too low, it is adjustable, which I haven't done the adjustable straps yet. It is rather low at the sides, so I definitely think it would be better maybe with like a bikini or a nice bralette as opposed to what I've got on. But um, I really like this one as well. It's thick, so it isn't steep throughout, so it's like double layered, so I really am very happy with this one. I got this belt, which is actually the exact same to the one that I'm wearing at the moment. I had this, I got this years ago, I don't know if you can see. It's like a western silver belt. I got this years ago, I think from a similar website, maybe Romwe or Choeys or something. And I've worn it to death. This one is literally, it's, it's on its way out. So while I saw it on there, I thought I'd pick that one up. And that was just under $8. Next is another item that they picked out for me. This is just a little tank top. This was $11.49. It's in size medium. And it's just literally like a grey mull tank top. And it ties at the bottom here. It's not something that I usually pick out for myself. But I think it's one of those basics that literally, if you don't wear it out, it'd be great on holiday or just for lounging days. Like it's super soft. So... I'm actually quite impressed with that. I think I'll get more use out of that one than I realise. I'm very, very pleasantly surprised with this one. I think this is going to be great, especially on holiday, to wear with maybe like a bikini or if I'm walking about. I'm very, very happy with this one. It's really nice quality and it's really soft as well. And you can tie this yourself, so it's adjustable to how tight you want it. And yeah, I just really like this one, so I'm very happy. This top was $18.49, which is a little bit more expensive like sort of on the scale of their tops. And it is quite thin. It's not bad quality, it's just 
not kind of $20 worth of top I don't think. It's just a little v-neck top, it's kind of fitted under your boobs, it comes down quite low which might be an issue with me and my flat chest but we shall see. But if it does look nice then this would be great because like I think dark grey is one of those colours that suits everyone. Right so excuse the deodorant stain I've just managed to get on this one but this top I really like how it looks and how it fits. The V isn't too low um, which is great because it doesn't show too much in my chest but the arms are very tight and I have quite small arms so I definitely would size up because it is, isn't very stretchy so I'm kind of hoping that maybe if I wash it a couple times it should soften it maybe. I do really like it so I'm hoping to make this work somehow. But yeah, just be bear in mind if you do want to buy this then it is a little bit tight. Next up just another little basic top. This was $9.99 and it's just a little black knitted vest top. These are everywhere at the moment. I have a white one and a blue one that I got from other shops like Primark and New Look I think. Uh, so I just thought this little black one would be cute, again for holiday, even if, you know, I just want to chuck it over a bikini or with some statement like bottoms or a nice skirt or something. So yeah, that's cute. Again, like a lot of the others, this top is such nice quality. It's going to be a staple basic in my wardrobe and I can really see myself wearing this on holiday. I think it'll be really cute. It's really, really stretchy and it's really thick as well. Soft knitted material. So I'm very, again, very happy with this one. All right, next up I have a phone case that I've actually been using on my phone. I couldn't resist, it was too cute. This was $5.04 and it's just a little, it's like a clear plastic case or silicone case and it's got banana leaf print all over it. I just thought it was a little bit summery, a little bit cute, a little bit different and I love ordering phone cases off of Zaffle. They're one of my favourite things from there. They have so many like marble ones and things so that's really cute, I can't complain there. Next up I ordered two of these same bikini in different colours because I just think they, they looked so cute. So again if they fit um they will look great but the problem with me is i don't like buying sets of bikinis because i'm a different size on top than i am the bottoms i'm sure a lot of people are so i got this bandeau bikini set i got a white one and a black one it comes with little cups in it and i think the top actually is really thick considering it's a white bikini usually they're a little bit like see-through um but it is really good quality material i'm very impressed with this one so for the set of these it was 13.99 uh the bottoms actually look rather large i got a size i believe i got a size medium in these but they actually look massive i'm not gonna lie i think the color of it doesn't help either because they kind of look like granny pants so they were supposed to be like a high-waisted pant bottom thing but i think you can see they look quite big and i have quite i don't know we'll see the top fits great i think it um i'm probably end up gonna probably gonna end up wearing these on holiday as well as a black one just with different bottoms because i don't know how you can see but they are just a little bit sort of nappy-ish. I think they're supposed to be like high-waisted bottoms, but they kind of just look a little bit too big. It might have been different if I sized down, but they're definitely like way too baggy. So that's a real shame, but I definitely think I'm going to still get my use out of the tops for both the bikinis, just with different bottoms. I did also get a phone tripod from them, uh, just for like vlogging and things. Um, I have a feeling I might have left that at uni, so if I can find it, I'll insert a little clip of it. If not, I'll put a photo of it on the screen. And the phone tripod was only $3.23, so that is great. And last up, I got two jewellery pieces. So first up, I have these earrings. I've been hugely into statement earrings at the moment, and I love my silver jewellery as well. So I saw these on the website. I thought they were very cute and very like Danielle Carroll inspired. So they're just silver hoop earrings, but they're in the shape of stars, so I thought they were really cool. And these were just over $3. And then I got this three-layer necklace. The bottom layer is just like this large crescent moon necklace, like the one I usually wear that I don't actually have on today. Middle layer is just like a gem necklace, and then this one on top as well. So I just think they, they would look really cute together um, on top of a bikini or just a nice little play suit or something. And this was just under $4. So that is everything that I have to show you. Obviously, as usual, I haven't tried on the products yet, so I can't tell you. 100% that I loved everything but the things that I have tried on and the things that I've kind of felt and and the quality of what things look like at least then I'm very very impressed as I always am with Zaffle. I have obviously done Zaffle hauls in the past but I just think because like their stock's constantly changing and things it's nice to sort of do updated reviews and you guys know that I'm always going to be honest with you so yes I hope you guys enjoy this I hope you found this helpful and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon for another video. Bye!